Ultra Pro back again for another video. Uh, this is going to be my last one on the Jaguar for a little while, for a couple of weeks. Uh, I'm going to try and focus on some Dreamcast stuff for a couple of videos, and uh, I treat you guys to another Jaguar video later on down the line. I do have plans for the Jaguar. I plan to do some uh, Phase Zero, Skyhammer. Uh, there's a couple others that I want to do as well. I can't remember what they are off the top of my head right now. I've never played Baldies. I've never played Mutant Attack of the Mutant Penguins. I've only played a little bit of Towers. I've never played Robinson's Requiem, even though I have it. I've got the Soul Star demo, which was never completed, the game itself. But for now, the video that I'm going to show you today is Super Burnout on the Atari Jaguar. It's a great little racing game. I wasn't ex expecting very much from it, to be honest, when I got it. The graphics are similar to Hang On. But they're of a higher quality and a high t higher detail. Uh, the, dr the draw distance is nice. It's, it, it's a nice smooth game and it it plays really well on the Jaguar. Uh, I don't know if you can see on there the um, the little picture on the bottom right corner, uh, left corner rather, um, and the graphics on the back there. Any of you who have ever played Hang On, you'll know what I'm talking about. It's just sprites that drive down a track and you just lean left and right. Um, it's the same sort of thing for car games like Outrun, Batman Returns on the Mega CD, uh, similar to Hang On, similar to Road Rash, Skitchin. But for me, I, I actually have to say that this is probably the best of its kind uh, in terms of motorbike racing from the 16-bit era, you know. And it, it surprised me how good it plays. I'm not that good at it yet. Some races I can get into first, others I only get into about sixth, fourth or fifth. Uh, but I'm getting there. I'm trying to play with a f moderate, a medium, st a medium statistic bike. Uh, I tried one with high acceleration but rubbish handling, and I just couldn't play the game at all. So <laughs> I have to have some form of handling. Anyway, it's a lov lovely little game for the Jaguar, and I would suggest that anyone who owns the Jaguar definitely goes out and buys it. It's not particularly expensive. Uh, you should be able to get a nice quality on less than thirty odd pound or so. I would have thought. Uh, yeah, so anyway, I hope you enjoy the video. Any feedback, any requests, any comments, let me know via my channel or via Dreamcast Talk or via Retro Video Gamer. And yeah, I look forward to uploading some more videos soon. Hope you enjoy the video. Bye. Ready, set, go! Best time, two laps to go.
this time, by no left. Ready, set, go! Best time, two laps to go. Ready, set, go!
best time by no lap Ready? Set? Go! Best time, two laps to go. Best time, final lap. Best time.
this time, two laps to go. This time, final lap. <laughs> 